A youngster makes a big mistake that could have derailed his entire life. But through hard work, genuine ability, and good fortune, he's charting a new course. Here's Alicia Smith with tonight's Detroit 2020 Person of the Week. Rashawn Brown says freedom is being on the court shooting hoops, but he learned that the hard way. He's a star player, number 34, the center for Wayne County Community College District's basketball team. But 25 year old Rashawn Brown isn't your traditional student athlete. I've been playing any, any foot, like any football, basketball, no, no sports. In grade school, he basically only played video games. And when he was 16, he made some bad choices and was arrested for home invasion. He spent time in juvenile detention. Then at 17, he transitioned to prison. Hard time, six years, eight months. I've started playing basketball as cardio. Other inmates couldn't help but notice his raw talent. They would come to me like, have you ever played anywhere? I know somebody that, that did this and went home and they, they, just, they just put it in my mind, gave me the vision that so many things can unfold just by basketball alone. Three days after he got out of prison, two years ago, he was playing a pickup game at an LA Fitness in Southfield when his skills were noticed by one of the regulars, Terrence Wheeler, a Pac-12 Hall of Famer who played basketball overseas for years. I said, well, do you want to go to college? I asked him, do you have his GED? And he said, yes. So I don't even think that he thought about going to college, but I knew that he had some potential. And when Wheeler learned that Brown was fresh out of prison, that didn't deter him. The antidote to poverty is opportunity. You know, if the judge didn't give him a life sentence, why should we? So Wheeler put a call in to his friend, WCCCD coach Roderick Turner, who upon hearing of Brown's ability, offered him a scholarship to play sight unseen. He's the kind of young man that every coach dreams for. Really? Not only a hard worker on the basketball court, but even in a classroom. Brown became the team captain as a freshman and is currently on the Dean's List. One thing I had learned during my incarceration was about time. And one thing I refused to do was waste it. Brown's accomplishments have even inspired others. His teammate and friend Jalen Dixon was going through a tough time last year and Brown reminded him to never give up. He always bring up the three stages of him going into prison and the things that he did that he shouldn't have done, how, how strong he was to, to encounter and do all that, and then come back home and make such a significant change. The beautiful thing about a lot of people is that once you exceed somebody's expectations, especially your own, then that's when everything be, becomes wonderful. And that's why Rashawn Brown is this week's Detroit 2020 Person of the Week. Rashawn Brown gets off of parole in April and he's on track to graduate from WCCCD this summer and his coach says he's likely to get offers from several four year schools. We wish him all the best. I'm Alicia Smith, 7 Action News. Boy, it's never too late to nope, turn it around, right? right? No, no matter man, how dark things look. Seems to be on the right track. Absolutely.